Hey yo, welcome back to the final episode of Nunderson. At least the bonus episodes. This is the last one. We're checking out a mod that I can relate to. Not really, but we're gonna pretend I can relate to. Cause shout out to my Mushroom Origins. It's the Shrooms mod. Now, low key the mushroom biome, high key I guess we can say. High key the mushroom biome is one of my favorite biomes in vanilla Terraria. I fuck with that heavy. And uh, I don't know if you can tell here, but we're wearing some pretty garbage ass gear. And that's because we're checking out the shrooms mod. Just a little tiny mod that I thought I'd give a nice spotlight on before I ended off this series. And obviously ending off the series, we're going to hop into Uncle Karius. Now, I would do like a little little bit more story stuff, story and lore things, cutscenes, but in my opinion, I just spit on my fucking mic and it's everywhere. Oh my god, sorry if this sounds weird. I'm trying to clean it. Okay. Now, in my opinion, Terraria doesn't have the tools in-game. Maybe mods give out the tools, but I don't know. I feel like I'd have to do a little bit of searching to find the right mods, but I feel like Terraria doesn't have the tools to make, you know, cool-looking cutscenes and shit. Some epic story slash movie things you can do with it, like Gmod, Minecraft, f I don't know, probably fucking Roblox has better tools. But nonetheless, I'll figure out something in the future, maybe. I really want to have, I wouldn't say my bitch, but <laughs> I really want to have a developer and let, until I learn how to code. I really want to have a developer on my side to, uh, to help allow me to have things for my own mod. When I say things for my own mod, I mean like if I wanted to do lore things and have a certain item or certain enemy for like a part of the story, then I can just have a mod developer on my side just, you know, create it. Maybe I can sprite it and then they just, you know, program the AI and all that shit. But yep, yeah, we'll see in the future. I want to learn Terraria coding some sometime. I will eventually, maybe, I don't know. But hey, Godline Strike is gone. You guys may be like, fight the fucking boss. All right, chill out chill out we're gonna fight a boss and then i'll talk about my guideline strike so we're supposed to fight the uh magical mushroom first this one right here i'll show you the crafting recipe i guess uh it's not that hard uh, surprisingly i didn't have the stuff for it but uh you know just did some bit bop booping and we have the stuff for it is that from the shroom mod too yeah look there's a couple of items right here throwable vicious stuff what the fuck is that? That is ugly. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, this is how you make the magical one. And this is how you make the suspicious one. So magical. Use it in a glowing mushroom biome at night. Oh, we can do that very easily. We head over here to the dungeon. Peep this. Everyone's going to ask what's on my back. It's this. It's from the juice mod. Don't ask. You want to see something weird? What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> That's all we're doing with that. No, 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 no. Get this off my screen. I wanted to make it nighttime. I wanted to make it nighttime. Get off my screen. All right. Is it nighttime? It's nighttime. All right. Ready, set, activate. What the fuck? Illuminati. Oh, that's the wrong weapon. I was insta kill. I meant to use the bone glove. No, we'll use this one. Just use something. All right. Just don't insta kill him. Just use this and just toss at him. So he's got a little, he's got a little, uh, oh my god, he started going really fast. He's got that Brain of Cthulhu type AI. I'm just standing here, I'm not even doing anything. And I didn't mean to kill him instantly, so we're gonna fight him again. It's good that I made two of each. Do you have any relation to the mod, sir? I don't think he does. But let's do it again. Let's watch his AI, because this is something I really want to watch. Look at this hatchet, sapling hatchet going in. He's doing work. What are you doing here? Can you not be here, sir? I would appreciate it. In the middle of fighting. All right, let's use Cactus Glove against this boss. No, not my boy Shiitake. Not Shiitake the mushroom. It's really hard to like not insta kill him because we just do so much damage in this playthrough. But pretend that we didn't have this much health. Like, look, we would have already been dead. And he curses you when he hits you. We would have already been dead, man. All right, maybe I'll include this mod. No, nah, I'll only include this mod in a future playthrough. What the fuck is hitting me? Goddamn mushroom. I'll only include this mod in a future playthrough if they fix that sprite. What is that? That's disgusting. What is that? Ew. It's so nasty. It's so nasty. If you need someone to sprite something, I'm right here. I probably wouldn't do that. You can probably ask someone in my Discord, though. They'd probably be down. Armor doesn't look too bad. 
I fucks with it. Uh, going mushroom repeater. That's cool. They can get a repeater early game. Can we? Can we stop bullying me? Okay. Let me just chill out. I'm trying to look at things. We got this. Is this is expert item? I think. Spawns a glowing mushroom at your cursor location. Okay, that's interesting. That's a fucking evolutionary oh, bubonic scourge. Did they change its name? Didn't the name of that enemy used to be evolutionary beast? Maybe I'm just tripping. Uh, let's kill all these enemies. Keep on fucking bothering me. Glowing mushroom pet. Ooh, Ooh. A little mushroom. A little bit of. Ooh, need a little mushroom. But I get your, it's a glowing pet. It doesn't glow that much for being a glowing pet. And then let's. Oh no, that's the expert drop. So we just got this one multiple times. Magic mushroom. Did I see what this does? Yes, I did. Uh, soul of shrooms. So this makes the other. Ooh, this makes mushroom helmet. So this is throwing set. Nice. This is mushroom headgear. So you make this with that. What the fuck is that? Elemental mushrooms. I don't know what this mod adds in. I didn't. I looked at the forum page for a second. Glowing magic mushroom. There's a yo-yo. Nice. Nice. I see you. Mushroom bow. Let's get some of the mushroom throwing weapons for this next boss. How about that? Let's head back home. We're gonna we're gonna put these in here. Everything else we just we'll sell. I guess I don't know. I'm not gonna use it. But we'll put that in there. And then with that being in there, we're going to make us some of those throwable mushrooms so we can use them against the next boss. 300. I don't know if these all do different things or what, but we're making a bunch. All right, there you go. Damn, they do some pretty good damage. Pretty good damage. All right, we're just going to use this. We're not going to use anything else. We can put these away. So next, this boss I think is actually after Skeletron, the ancient one. Uh, use it at night. Okay, that's nice and easy. You know what? Let me disable something real quick. Let me disable the night wraith or whatever the fuck it's called because it keeps spawning in and bothers my fights. I don't appreciate that sacred tools. Thought that was gonna get fixed. We can fight it right here. We can fight it right here. Let's do it, boys, girls too, and whatever else you are. Uh, what the fuck is going on here? This is kind of cool looking. What's going on here? Where, where's that arm going? <laughs> All right, so he's got, let's see here, mushroom guardian. He's got a regular one. I think that's a vicious, yeah, there's a vicious one. Glowing mushroom one. The other arm just said, fuck it, he dipped. He ain't want none of this. All right, let's get up in this. This part's a lot different than what it looked like on the on the forum page. So I don't, I don't know, there's some updating going on here. Interesting though. It looks cool, I like this boss. Maybe the sprite doesn't look very Terraria-like, but still, I like it. Maybe they will use this mod. Nah, like I said, I'll only use this mod if they fix the sprite. Go on the forum page and tell them to fix. Nah, you can't do that. You'll get fucking reported. All right, go on the forum page and say I did a video and tell them to watch the video. You watching the video, mod dev? I like your mod. Uh, can you change up the sprite of that mushroom soul or shroom soul, please? And I'll add it into my mod. It's just it's a nasty sprite, man. No offense. I'm not, I don't say I'm the greatest spriter, but like. I wouldn't say that I'm even close. I still have trouble spreading in Terraria. Oh, okay, never mind. So he does it going. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. It's nice and simple. It's got a Terraria like feel to it. That might even be advanced for Terraria. There's not too many bosses that do like phase changes like this. Like there's one phase and then switch it to another one. Plantera is one of the ones that come off. What the fuck is that? And then it goes into another phase. This is insane. Where's this one going? That one just leaves. This is insane for a post Skeletron boss. Maybe, yeah, it's post Skeletron. I think it's like directly after Skeletron. What you guys think? You guys let me know in the comments. I'm kind of feeling this mod. I can get past the ugly sprites. I'm kind of feeling it. But I would prefer if those sprites were changed. I'll show you guys what I sprite. There's, an, there's two items in the juice mod that I sprite it. I, in my opinion, they look pretty good, but I don't know. Your opinion, in my opinion, two different things. I'm recording this at like 8 in the morning, 9 in the morning. Uh, I haven't slept for like 13 or 14 hours. <laughs> but I'm trying to fix my sleep schedule, so don't worry. I'm almost kind of insane, but I'll fix it. I promise you. I've done it before. I fucked up my sleep schedule once in the past, and then I fixed it. 
by staying up but when i tried when i stayed up and fixed it i wasn't tired at all i don't know what the hell was going on it's been on that cocaine and the hookers i fucked the day before yeah that was a dope boss i liked it like i said i'm repeating myself there a hundred times the sprites are ugly just my honest opinion look at it even the gore is cool uh arcane discounted this discounted I don't know if that's supposed to say discounted. Is discounted a word? It's a word I've never heard of. 50% chance to not consume thrown items. Nice. That would have been helpful in this playthrough, right? 50% chance. That's actually not that high. Uh, Guardian Poisonous Ring of Shrooms. This is an expert item. Cast a Poison Nova when an enemy is near. Alright, let's get at it. We'll, we'll just fight him again. Ooh. How long is the cooldown? Not that long. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna go for a quick kill here. Is there a way I can kill it quickly? Yo, the fucking vile one stayed here, or the vicious one. I don't know which one's which. We're gonna go for a quicker kill. We're gonna use this. We seen the boss. You guys seen the boss. It's cool. I fucks with it. I want I want to hear you guys' uh, opinions in the comment. What was I talking about? Oh, I was talking about my guideline strikes are gone. But I applied for a partnership on a at TGN. The gaming network is a pretty known. I think it's pretty known. I'm not, I don't know, but like people like Etika, Vintage Beef, uh, fuck, there was something else that was really popular. They were with it too. I don't remember. Those are the ones that came off the top of my head. Uh, I applied for a partnership on their page, and it said like, give us, give us a minute. We're gonna let you talk to a live representative to like finish the applying process. I waited like an hour. Nobody, <laughs> no live representative to show up. That's some YouTube type shit. But yeah, hopefully we get partnered soon. The reason I'm bringing that up is because I'm not starting the fishing fishing playthrough until we get partnered. So hopefully by the end of this week, we'll be partnered and I can get some episodes out to you guys. But since this is, oh my god, we look so fucking ugly. Since this is, since this is the last bonus episode, I just want to tell you guys, I might be doing some fist episodes. I might be doing some fist episodes in the meantime. Until then, I don't know. Would you guys like to see that? I don't know. Don't don't put that in the comments that you'd like to see that. Tell me, would you guys like to see this mod, the shrooms mod, with updated, with a little bit better spriting? If you guys would like to see that in the next mod pack, in the Fisher mod pack to be exact, tell me. All right, we're gonna look at things I sprited. I sprited these two. I think I did pretty good. It took me a while to sprite them. I like them. Juice fixed them up to make them the terraria size because I have trouble spriting with terraria size. Look at, look at, they even got a falling at face. That's amazing. Can I get closer? That's the closest I'm getting. Look at this. Who, who remembers the multiplayer? This guy's tongue flaps back and forth. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hold up. I, I didn't do the clap. Hope you guys enjoyed the Nundersin throwing playthrough. He turned out to be one of the strongest orcs so far, but there's still a lot of orcs that have yet to be shown. For example, I think Book, he's going to be really goddamn strong. Same thing with Grognak, he's a melee character. Melee characters are always strong. I don't know what to say about the healer character or the fishing character. We'll see. But yeah, that's the end of Nunderson's playthrough. Thank you guys, everyone, for watching. I know, like, this whole entire playthrough, we weren't monetized or partnered but i appreciate everyone who sticks with me you know i've been doing this content just as like a hobby for you guys i enjoy you guys reactions and comments and uh hopefully that we got past this like hard part of my youtube career we can hop back in and feel like it was nothing again like we never got laid off by youtube pretty much shout out youtube fuck them thanks for watching